Respondent fatigue and survey legitimacy are two things that we hear increasingly more and more in the digital era we live in. How, therefore, does an organisation like Beaton continue to give our clients confidence that we are providing them reliable data with that as a backdrop? Well, one such thing we have implemented is sponsorship. Sponsorship in simple terms is where the recipient of a survey request is made aware of which organisation has provided their details. Two important questions need answering in the context of sponsorship. One, does sponsorship lift response rates? And two, does it have any impact in terms of bias on how the respondent behaves and indeed responds to the survey? Well, to find answers to those questions, we've analysed our own data extensively and also conducted substantial amount of research internationally to give us confidence. Question one, does it drive response rates? Well, unequivocally, the answer is yes. We have seen healthy lifts in response rates, which then gives us greater confidence that we can provide more reliable data to our clients. Two, around bias and behaviour of the respondent. Again, our data and the research confirms that the impact is minimal, with one important caveat, and that is anonymity. The impact is minimal if the respondent is assured of their anonymity, that their responses will not be revealed at an individual level to an organisation. At Beaton, for many years, we have always assured respondents of their anonymity and we will continue to do so to therefore remove bias from any survey that we are conducting. So the conclusion, sponsorship is a good thing. It drives up response rates and has minimal impact on how the respondent behaves and responds to that survey.